Hi, it's Deborah Garrison, and I've been testing a video sitemap plugin that automatically creates a video sitemap for your blog, and we'll show you how to add it and install it. You just upload it just like any other plugin. You browse for your file, choose your Google Video sitemap, and install it. This is an upgrade, so Everything's already set up, but we're going to activate our plugin. And on the settings, you can choose to have permalinks for your sitemap, or you can choose to ignore or include your YouTube videos. The videos, that, however, from YouTube or Easy Real Player are not indexed by Google and don't show up on the search engines. So we're going to save the changes. There's 267 posts with video content. And we're going to regenerate our little sitemap. You need to regenerate it after you've added a new video. And we're going to view our sitemap. Now this sitemap does include the YouTube videos that I've added in from Auto Content Cache. Yeah, they're posted automatically. I pick the garden um, keyword and any videos on gardening shows up automatically in my blog. So I have some content that people can refer to. And then I also put in my own videos. And the videos that are inserted on my blog are the ones that are indexed by Google on the video sitemap. So there's my sitemap, and let's go check and see where some of these videos are ranking. So here's my Mayan hammocks, and as you can see, the Garden Arbor and Trellis hammock is ranked second on the Google Video sitemap, and uh, some of my other videos are showing up there on YouTube, and my other ch YouTube channels are uh, videos, video site channels. Let's see some of the other videos that I have posted on my blog, how well they're doing. This is Wood Arbors. Uh, there's my YouTube, my Garden Arbor and Trellis. And my other video. If you really want your videos to rank, you need to put them on more than one video site. There's garden trellises. Again, garden arbor trellis shows up in the top search searches. Here we go and look for cat garden statues. And there's garden arbor and trellis again. And now we're going to look for the white vinyl arbors. I have a video on my site, but it turned out to be a YouTube video that I put in there. So we're going to go back and create the video and, and use it, upload it with the S3 Media Player, and then put it in the blog and see how quickly it shows up in the search engines. So I like to use the S3 Media Player. It's by Mike Stewart. From, he's a StomperNet's faculty member now. He has a great class on how to do make videos. And this little plug-in puts your videos up on the Amazon S3 in, the, in your little buckets. So I either use an MP4 or a Flash file. We're going to upload that. While that's uploading, we're going to find my front thumbnail picture. And the picture needs to be the same size as what you'll be putting on the blog. Um, I'm using the 480 by 360, so that was a 480 by 360. Now then I'm making a forward or redirect UL, URL. Whenever the video finishes playing, it will redirect directly to my affiliate site, and I created a redirect link so that my long affiliate URL is now in the Go Arbor. The S3 Media Player, you can select whatever height and size you want, whatever color you want your skin. There's four different video skins available. And you can click Auto Start or Preload if you want. You can generate your code. 
At the bottom you make a link text and this is another redirect link so that if they click on that they go directly to the affiliate site to get their arbors. Again I created the redirect link earlier using my Dreamweaver. And you can choose same window or new window at that button on the right. And you can also disable the controls if you just want them to see it without turning it off. So we're going to go back to my site, the, the post that has the video, the YouTube video. We're going to replace the YouTube video with my S3 Media Player video. Then we'll just save that video, regenerate the site map. Here's the post. So when they click on this video and play the video, it will automatically redirect them to the affiliate website, the Simply Arbors, or they can click on the Order Arbors Now button at the bottom that we created and you will take them directly to the Simply Arbors affiliate site. It will take them to wherever you want them to go. So there's our Simply Arbors website. Let's go back to the post. And we're going to regenerate our site map. This time I'm going to ignore the YouTube videos just to see which videos are on my site that I have inserted. So we got to save those changes and regenerate. It automatically pings the search engine and you can also put on there how often you want the ping engine pinged. You don't want it pinged too often or Google will get irate with you. So here are all my videos that I've put into my blog post. We'll check and see where my white arbor video is. There it is. White garden arbors. Let's go to Google and check and see if it's showing up yet. It takes uh, a couple hours for it to show up. Let's go to Google. So it's not showing up just yet, but the next morning I checked it again ran the white vinyl arbors and lo and behold there is our video that we just posted yesterday showing up in the top rankings of the Google so when we click on that video rather than going through YouTube or one of the other video websites this video takes you directly to the website or your blog rather so here we go. Click on that. I hope this video has been useful and you can pick up your GVS plugin at 101videomarketing.com and your S3 Media Player is available at 101videomarketing.com. Go S3 Media. I hope this has been an educational video and I hope this helps your video marketing. Thanks for watching.